Castle Greyskull on the rocky, battle-torn planet of Eternia, locked within its cold walls, lie all the ancient wisdom and mystical secrets of ages past. I am He-Man, sworn to protect Castle Greyskull from the forces of evil by the force of my magical sword of power. <laughs> I, Skeletor, shall gain control of Castle Grayskull's secrets and become King of Eternia! <laughs> and now, He-Man faces his deadliest enemy, Skeletor, in the battle for Castle Grayskull. Chapter 1, The Caverns of Fear. As dawn breaks, He-Man races across the plains of Eternia, astride his mighty steed, Battle Cat. There's Castle Grayskull. Let's stop at the well for a drink, Battle Cat. I've been working you pretty hard, haven't I? What is this strange sound from the well? I must find out. Caverns. I've heard there were caverns under Castle Grayskull. I must find out where they lead. You'll go no further, He-Man. Merman, you slimy monster. This time you won't escape, He-Man. It'll take more than you to stop me, Thin Face. <laughs> Sounds like a battle down this passage. So that's it. Tila fighting Skeletor. He-Man. I saw Skeletor steal into the well and follow him here. I shall end your meddling forever! Skeletor plans to enter Castle Grayskull through this passage. As He-Man starts forward... Not so fast, He-Man. You will not stop me, Beast-Man. Happy landing, Furface. You shall not interfere with my plan, He-Man! Your evil will never possess Castle Grayskull. As He-Man and Skeletor battle, Sly Trapjaw takes Teela by surprise. Stop, He-Man, or she's finished! You are in for a fight, Trapjaw. <laughs> Trapjaw's inhuman strength overpowers Teela. Yield, He-Man! Release her instantly. Man at arms, you found us. An instant later, Stratos, Prince of the Skies, swoops down and lifts Tila to safety. Thank you, my friend. He-Man swings his sword at Skeletor, but the Lord of Destruction vanishes. Only a green mist remains. There seems to be no end to Skeletor's cowardly magic. We must make sure no one ever tries to enter Castle Grayskull by these caverns again. He-Man's sword flashes again and again, tearing at the cavern walls. Run, my friends! Run! The caverns are collapsing. Hurry! Run! Run! There it is! We're almost there! The heroes reach the surface. Stone seals the caverns forever. Battle Cat greets them. Battle Cat found us, He Man. When we saw him alone, we knew you were in trouble. So we followed him here. You are a faithful and clever friend, Battle Cat. But had Skeletor really been beaten? Chapter 2 in the Land of the Shadows. Having driven Skeletor from the caverns under Castle Grayskull, the masters of the universe paused to savor their victory. Suddenly... Look at that sky! Something's wrong! The ground is beginning to shake! Castle Grayskull is moving! This is Skeletor's work! As the masters of the universe watch, a whirlwind rips Castle Grayskull from the Earth and carries it skyward. <laughs> Castle Grayskull's secrets will soon be mine! <laughs> He-Man leaps up to hold Castle Grayskull. 
I have to hold on. I can't stop it. I have you, He-Man. Thank you, my friend. But the winds are too strong for Stratos. The two friends are sucked into the tornado. Stratos, save yourself! No, Skeletor has not beaten us yet. He-Man draws his sword and plunges it into the mountainside with all his might. Hold on, Stratos. This time, I thank you, He-Man. Good work, Stratos. Thank heavens you're safe, He-Man. None of us is safe now. Skeletor has stolen Skull and its secrets. Meanwhile, Skeletor watches at Snake Mountain. <laughs> My plan is working perfectly, Beast Man. Castle Grayskull is mine! Now we must go to the land of the shadows to claim it! And to claim final victory at last! Arriving in the land of shadows, Skeletor chants an ancient spell. Storm winds howl and storm winds shriek! Bring me that which I seek! Now He-Man will come looking for the castle, and here he will meet his doom! <laughs> I am certain that Skeletor has taken Castle Grayskull to the Land of Shadows, and there we must go. Riding Battle Cat, He-Man leads the Masters of the Universe into the forbidding Land of Shadows. This land is vast, but we will find Castle Grayskull. On they press, deeper into the darkness, fighting an ever-growing feeling of dread, they search for Castle Grayskull. There it is, defended by a demon army. To the land of shadows! You know who we are and why we are here, Skeletor! He-Man leaps to the top of the castle wall, but is greeted by Skeletor's laser cannon. The secrets of Grayskull will soon be mine! <laughs> you cannot win, He-Man! Here, I am all-powerful! And we are Grayskull's defenders! Yield! Enough! I surrender! Be careful, He-Man! It's a trick! No trick! Magic! No, no! Ah! Skeletor vanishes in a blinding flash as the masters of the universe shield their eyes. With Skeletor gone, the evil spell over the Land of Shadows is broken. The rocky, barren land becomes fertile again. Skeletor will move on. There will be other shadow lands. Perhaps. But for now, the beauty has returned to this land. You saw how Skeletor's evil magic was turned against him. Remember, Wrongdoing has a way of coming back to punish those responsible. Just like doing good often brings its own rewards.
here stands Castle Grayskull on the rocky, battle-torn planet of Eternia. Locked within its cold walls lie all the ancient wisdom and mystical secrets of ages past. I am He-Man, sworn to protect Castle Grayskull from the forces of evil by the force of my magical sword of power. I, Skeletor, shall gain control of Castle Grayskull's secrets and become King of Eternia! <laughs> and now, He-Man faces his deadliest enemy, Skeletor, in... The Eye of Eternia! Chapter 1, The Sword of Knowledge. Point Dread, on the borders of Eternia, is under attack by Skeletor's demons. As dawn breaks, the masters of the universe storm ashore. He-Man and his warriors arrive to fight the demons and protect Point Dread. To arms! Skeletor's forces must not take Point Dread. We're with you, He-Man. Look out, they're attacking. Fierce battle rages, but the masters of the universe cannot be driven back. Skeletor sends his fiends to do his dirty work. They will not take this land! Ah! He-Man's power sword destroys oh, us! Oh, we we oh, cannot win! Oh. Look! The cowards retreat! This battle was too easy, He-Man. Yes, I suspect their retreat is part of Skeletor's scheme. Be on guard, my friends. Oh! Look out! A giant water hand! It's lifting He-Man! He-Man gasps for air as irresistible force drags him beneath the surface. The tidal force of the surging water twists He-Man's weapon from his grasp. Evil Merman grabs the sword as He-Man struggles. Skeletor will be pleased. <laughs> now he will own both halves of the power sword. He-Man is trapped as Merman makes good his escape. Moments later, in the shadow of Castle Grayskull. Here, my lord, take He-Man's half of the power sword. Joined with the mighty power I possess, this sword will open to me the secrets of Grayskull. When I join He-Man's sword to mine, I will have the key that will open Grayskull's vaults. <laughs> In a blinding flash, the two halves of the power sword become one. <laughs> the power sword is one at last! The secrets of the universe belong to me! Skeletor, the prize is ours! No, Finface, you fool! It is mine! <laughs> With a vicious plunge, Skeletor thrusts the sword into Grayskull's hidden lock, lowering the jaw bridge. Meanwhile, muscles straining, He-Man struggles desperately, and with one last mighty effort, he snaps the vines that hold him prisoner and drives toward the surface with powerful strokes. We feared you had drowned, He-Man. No, Merman isn't the only one who can swim. If Skeletor has joined both halves of the Power Sword... We are doomed! We are unarmed against that monster still. We cannot give up. We must go to Castle Grayskull. And recapture the sword! The masters of the universe journey over stark and rocky terrain, hoping to reach Grayskull before it is too late. I fear Skeletor has already entered Grayskull. Without your power sword, you have only human weapons. And courage, Tila. We have our courage. Look, we have arrived. But too late. It is hopeless. It is never hopeless. I will call Zodak. His magical powers will help me regain the sword. Zodak! He-Man, I come. The balance of good and evil must be restored. You, He-Man, must be our champion. I accept the challenge. He's disappeared. Only to reappear in a flash of light inside Castle Grayskull. 
So, you found me, but you will never leave here alive. Come closer, coward. I demand that you return the sword, Skeletor. I am its rightful guardian. Never, He-Man! You don't frighten me, Skeletor. The trapdoor! Oh. Ah! Enjoy your trip, He-Man! <laughs> He-Man falls down, down to the pit and crashes to the floor of the dank dungeon beneath Grayskull. Welcome, He-Man. Skeletor promised I'd have you for my prize. My pleasure, Hack. Oof! Don't be a fool, He-Man! You are unarmed! I am armed, with the forces of justice! Up, up, and away! Looks like you're the booby prize, Furface! I remember a passage behind this door! Skeletor must be stopped! Skeletor is gone! I must find him quickly before he unlocks the Vault of Knowledge! Meanwhile, deep within the castle... How I have plotted to get this sword! But now, I need only turn it in the lock to enter the Vault of Knowledge! I shall possess the secrets of the universe! <laughs> Not if I can help it, Skeletor! You have no power to stop me! I have the sword! <laughs> I dare anything for Eternia and freedom! He-Man throws Skeletor to the ground. I cannot fight He-Man without a weapon! Skeletor reaches for the power sword, but only draws forth his evil half. I shall end your meddling forever! You'll have to do better than that! Now, we need on equal terms, Skeletor. Never! <laughs> the Lord of Destruction vanishes. Only a green mist remains. <laughs> Next time, He-Man, things will be different! <laughs> He-Man joins his friends outside the castle. Skeletor is gone. And the secrets of the Ancient Ones are safe. Yes, it's over for now. But why do I feel so uneasy? <laughs> you have not seen the last of me, He-Man! I promise you! <laughs> Chapter 2 The Eye of Eternia This is the beautiful palace of Eternia, home of King Randor and Queen Marlena. Prince Adam relaxes in the garden. It's a lovely day, isn't it, Cringer? Nearby, Orko, the palace magician, tries again to make a house of floating cards. Oh, no, not again. Adam's peace is interrupted by Tila. Look, it's the sorceress of Grayskull, Zor, in her falcon form. Something must be wrong or she wouldn't have come. Prince Adam draws his hidden sword and speaks the magical words. By the power of Grayskull, I... To Castle Grayskull, Battlegat. Zor, lead the way. At Grayskull, as He-Man charges over the jawbridge, Zor is transformed into the beautiful sorceress. There is great danger for Eternia. What is it, sorceress? Tell me. He-Man, look into the eye of Eternia, but beware, there is great risk. I am willing to take the risk. The eye reveals all foes in every dimension. Look. Skeletor's dark magic has transported them to the cosmic clock. With it, the Lord of Destruction can control time, unless we can discover a way to travel there and stop him. He can plunge Eternia into the darkness of eternal night. Or eternal winter. Or even move time backwards. To the beginning of time, destroying all life. Yes, He-Man. 
Skeletor and his evil henchmen will be all that remain. But how can we reach them? They are in another dimension. <laughs> I warned of the risk. Look out! He sees us watching. <laughs> We've been slimed! Skeletor's evil magic! <laughs> It's dragging us into the eye. He-Man's sword slices through the foul tentacles. Help me! It's pulling me in! Sorceress! Sorceress! The sorceress swirls through the eye of Eternia to the dark and mysterious dimension where Skeletor waits to enslave her in time. All is lost. Unless we go through the eye to release her, she is mine! <laughs> Meanwhile, as Orko entertains the Court of Eternia, the party is interrupted. For my next trick... Orko, no time for parlor tricks. We need real magic. Orko, we need your help. But, but... Quick! We must go through the Eye of Eternia. I'd rather pull a rabbit out of a helmet. Ta-da! Well, here goes nothing. I did it! The masters of the universe swirl through time, carried into a distant dimension. Their Skeletor has taken control of the cosmic clock. Hey, man, you dare face me? <laughs> Too late. I have the sorceress and the cosmic clock. <laughs> the sorceress is in a glass prison. The sorceress speaks directly into He-Man's mind. He-Man. If the cosmic clock strikes 12, Skeletor will control time forever. To arms! We must defeat Skeletor! Take that, Beastman! Yield, evil men! Merman is mine! Battlecat smashes the glass prison to free the sorceress. He-Man leaped to grab the pendulum of the cosmic clock. I must keep the clock from... Uh, from chiming. <laughs> Your puny strength can never overcome time! He-Man desperately struggles, while back at the palace, Orko watches the struggle through the eye. I gotta help! How can I help? How did I do it last time? He waves his arms and... The cosmic clock explodes, hurling the masters of the universe back through the eye of Eternia. You saved us. Great work, Orko. The sorceress is free. Good thing I kept my eye on things. <laughs> How's that for a timely rescue? And now, my friends, my famous floating house of cards. Ta-da! Oops! Orko, how can you send us through the Eye of Eternia and yet not finish a simple card trick? I guess my timing is a little off. <laughs> <laughs> Skeletor thought he was powerful enough to control time. But Orko proved that quick thinking may be more successful than strength. Remember, the more problems you solve, the more you'll learn. And knowledge is the true test of strength.